Hi, I'm Liz from Clean and Organised and tonight I'm going to show you my wonderful new walk-in wardrobe which I've recently organised. It's taken, it's been a three day project and I'm just so excited to show you. Let's have a look over here. This hanging space was the whole reason I started um, my organisation project in here. First off, if you notice, I've decided to make all my hangers matching. So they're all black and they sit really nicely and I just got these from like the $2 shop and they've just worked out really well for all of our hanging spaces. Nothing better than seeing a nice neat matching hangers in your wardrobe. But we, I live in North Queensland and it is winter here and I was finding I had no room or space for my winter winter clothes. I was finding that it was jam packed and I could hardly move and get all my clothes out. So I decided to come up with a different solution. By the way, notice that I have colour coordinated all my clothes because I'm just a little bit OCD in that sense. But anyway, I decided to purchase these sweater boxes and they have been a real great find for me and my wardrobe. I was looking online and trying to look everywhere I could think of to try and find some some sort of boxes to store my sweaters in and my coats and my jackets and I was thinking about purchasing some from the US for $25 but I found these from the reject shop for only $8 and they have just been amazing and I'm so glad I purchased them. So if you can come closer you can see that I've labelled each of the um, each of the boxes with a um, just a bit of cardboard with some pink scotch tape, and I've just labelled what's inside. So we've got coats, I've got um, cardigans here, and I've got jackets also, which has been really really good. Now you may wonder how the heck am I going to get these down? They're not that heavy, so I could pull them down. But I've found another great purchase from the reject shop as well, which has been really great find. Let me show you. I've got here a pink step stool and I love the polka dots but this was only $10 which was really really good and I like the fact that it just it folds so tightly up and it just it clicks apart like that and it can hold up to a weight of 120 kilos so that's perfect that's more than enough and I can just reach in there to be able to grab whatever um, I need for that so it's been really good Another thing I reorganised was my shelving space. Now I have a chest of drawers which I'll probably show you in a later post where I keep um, all my like t-shirts, my shorts, my underwear, things like that. So I just keep different things in here. So as you can see I keep my nail polish up here and I actually keep it on a cake stand which I think is just it's just a fun way of displaying the nail polish and I keep my jewellery in like not that I have much but just in the box there. I have put, um, I got the pink scotch tape and I just put the label over it and I just thought it was just nice to have a bit of pop of colour in, in the wardrobe and as you can see I've got all my shoes neatly laid out so I can see what shoes I wanted to wear as I um, each day and I just love the fact that I can see them because I'm a bit of a shoe girl. Um, <coughs> and it also keeps me under control with buying more shoes so if I purchase some more shoes I have to follow the one in one out rule which means that I need to if I purchase another pair of shoes one of these other pairs has to go to make way for it so that's just another way of keeping organized whenever you're trying to declutter your things if we come over this way we're going to look at my husband's um, side of the wardrobes because we share. So as you can see with his hanging space, I've divided it into sections. So his business shirts, his um, um, nice pants, his um, t-shirts and his site clothes there because he goes out to, he needs these work shirts like that. But he has, he doesn't have a chest of drawers, he prefers not to. So what I've done is I've labelled each of the shelves with what's con contained in here. Now I chose to use black scotch tape this time rather than pink because he's a boy and doesn't necessarily like pink as much. But I found here, this was a really good solution I found from Bargain Point and it, it was six dollars and it's a way of um, display um, of containing all your socks. So you can see here that we have here so 
you've got all he's got his his exercise socks and his um his work socks all nice and neatly contained i just have to wash them fold them up and just pop them there it's just a nice way of keeping things contained on the shelf rather than becoming a loose bundle i've also just let um put a um he's just folded his pants nicely and things like that now another storage solution which i'm really happy that i've done is this behind the door door pocket now it as you notice this is the same print as i got the sweater boxes but um, these were this was also from the reject shop and it was only six dollars so this was just really really good um, I did have it did come with over the door hooks but I found they were too round to be hung over the door so to counteract that problem I just put some 3m hooks up there just to you know make it make it sit but in here now you could do things like this, you could put your jewellery in here, you could put shoes in here. But what I've decided to do is put some of my scarves, um, just because, you know, you can just grab a scarf as you go. I've got some, um, some handbag straps, but I also have my belts, because I have belts for different skirts, for different dresses, and it's just an easy way to ca contain and find things easily, so I can just grab it out. I haven't labelled it yet because I've only done this today. But if I did, I'd probably just put a little bit of pink scotch tape here and then just write what kind of belt it is. So like this one, um, pink belt, um, like black thick strap, just to give an idea. So that is my tour of my walk-in wardrobe and I hope you enjoy. Um, please share if you um, enjoy it yourself and I hope to see you next time. Bye.